In this video tutorial, you will learn how to build forms using the Contact Form 7 plugin and BTheme. All of BTheme's contact forms are created using the Contact Form 7 plugin. If you do not have it installed, go to your WordPress dashboard, hover over the BTheme menu item, and click Install Plugins. Here you'll find the Contact Form 7 plugin, as well as other bundled plugins. Once we have the plugin installed and activated, we can start creating our form. First, find the contact menu item in your WordPress admin menu. Now by default, there will always be one form available. You can choose to edit this one or create a new one, what we will do. Click on Add New. As you can see, the form is populated with basic fields like name or email. The plugin author does not give the user any possibility to change the width of the input fields. To format those fields and change the arrangement, we use columns that are built into the theme. Since the plugin does not allow the user to use shortcodes, we need to use HTML to customize it. Don't worry, it is very simple to do. Let's remove all of the fields and create new ones. Here you can click on each field type to insert it into the form. We will start with a text field. Choose if the field is required for the user to fill. Next, put the name of the field. It's best to leave it as is. The default value field will let you set a placeholder. Let's add a couple more fields into this form. We'll probably need an email, a phone number, and a text area. Lastly, remember to insert a submit button so the user can send the message. Okay, we're almost done. Currently, the form fields will all display full width. If we would like to display them next to each other, we need to use the HTML code mentioned a while ago. For this, please type less than sign div space class equals quotation column space one quotation greater than sign before the first field and close this tag after the field ends with a less than sign forward slash div greater than sign. This will create a full width field since there is a one class in it. Okay, now we'll create two 50% width fields that will show next to each other. As previously, wrap the field, in this case, the email field in the HTML code, but this time do not use the one class. Use one dash second instead. Do the same with the phone number field. There are more possibilities for the field's width. We'll list all of them in the description box below the video, so be sure to check it out. When your form is ready, click the Save button. Now copy the short code and paste it anywhere on your website. It's best to use the column item in the Muffin Builder as we're doing so right now. Great! The contact form looks fantastic! To style the fields, please navigate to Theme Options inside your WordPress admin, then find the Colors menu item and click on Forms. Here you can change all of the colors, background transparency, border width, and radius. If you have any questions, please visit our support center at support.muffingroup.com.